So see here, this one is called demo02. So we assign this top node to our configuration. And this is the only node or the only hierarchy that will have budget availability check. So this is a configuration step, but then at any point of time during the, our life, we can add different subgroups and different GL accounts to the same hierarchy. But the top, the top level has to be assigned in configuration. I'm not going to go into the configuration step today because the video will be too long. I will focus on the end user steps. And then maybe if you are interested in this topic, I will create other videos later explaining the configuration. So this is the first step we have is to add the GL accounts to our GL account hierarchy. Now, the second condition, as we said, is the cost center master data or the cost center that we are posting to. We can activate the budget availability check on the level of each cost center. And also for each cost center, we say whether this cost center will have a budget or whether it will use the budget from another cost center. So in the example today, I have two cost centers, 1,000 and 2,000. Cost center 1,000 will be the budget carrying cost center. So it will be the cost center where I'm going to maintain my budget. While cost center 2,000 will not have a budget, but will use the same budget from cost center 1,000. So this way you can see how we can group together different cost centers under one budget, under, uh, under one budget that we maintain once.